Hey guys, it's Lynx Girl, and today I'm just gonna do some try something new, and I'm gonna start doing reviews on my dolls. Like I've known, I know I've done reviews before, but I just wanted to, you know, do them on my own instead of people requesting them. So that way, you know, if people want to know about a doll or something, I can just they can have my video for reference. So yeah, um, I'm gonna basically start off by doing. The dolls that I feel are the most complete, and the one th th those will mostly be like Jack specific dolls because they don't come with a lot of accessories, if any. So I think that makes my job pretty easy. Like for instance, the Believers dolls they only come with a brush and a card, but since those are basically the same for like everybody, and plus I didn't get them with Bloom and Stella, um. Yeah, I just feel like, you know, if you really wanted to know what it looked like, you could Google it, and I could probably leave a link down below for reference to the photos, I guess. So, let me stop rambling, and let's begin. So, her, first off, we're going to start with her makeup, which is, she has yellow eyeshadow, and on top, you can see, like, the little... little shimmery part if you put it in light there's like a random dent in my wall so yeah you can see right there right there all right so now on to her lips which are like a reddish orange color and i think it suits her nicely See, one thing about Jack specific dolls, they're not, as you can see, they're not always about detail, but what lacks in their everything else, it, they, make for, they make up for it in their wings because their wings are just beautiful with all this glitter. But I'll get to that in a second. So now her hair, as you can see, it's this blonde color. It's just a plain blonde color though. I mean, I would have liked some yellow, yellows in here, you know, to make it more red, like the show. I feel like Daphne's more of a blonde than Stella, but I think they gave Daphne yellow hair. I'm not sure. I don't know how good it looks. So yeah, um, her hair it's straight and it goes down to the back of her knees, and she has two pigtails that are they have. I like them because they contrast each other from like the waves contrast the straightness. You know, it's like bad quality but this is like in the early stages of the jack dolls I mean, all their dolls had bad hair quality but surprisingly my stellas are the best kept hair out of all my dolls for some reason i don't know but yeah they contrast each other because of the waviness and the straightness and i just think it looks nice plus it makes it look, look kind of like the show in a way and as you can see here's her pigtails on top so, yeah. Now let's move on to her outfit. She has this orange metallic-y like fabric. And it's like a crop top. And it shimmers in, this, in the sun a little bit. Or in the light. Because, you know, I don't have any light on. It's just pure sunlight. Um, her little trim that she has all around is... Here, I'm going to take off her wings. Right. Oh, kind of close there. Um, it's like a hot pink, red, and it gathers right around here, which I think it adds some nice detail. And she has um, hot pink ribbon as like straps, because this is supposed to be a shoulderless top. And I think it looks somewhat like the show. So, good job, Jax. Now we move down to her skirt. She has that same hot pink ribbon as a, like, belt or something. I'm not sure. And then it has a cute, adorable little bow right here. And then I think that's going to go with her as well. Because they don't have, like, the, the beads or the anything, really. So I think that's kind of nice and she has the same orange metallic-y fabric 
for the middle of the skirt. And here is the bottom with this tool. It is like a, it's not a hot pink, but it's a medium pink. It's not like a, it's just a pink. I don't know what type of pink it is really. It's almost like a purpley pink. But it could like that look like that just because of the sun. Let me see if it looks like that. Well, that light didn't really make much of a difference. So, yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead and say that it is a like light, not light pink, but like a dark, like dark light pink. There we go. I don't know. It's like the calmer. It's a warm pink. You know how there's like a hot pink. That's a warm pink. There you go. Making up new colors. <laughs> um, so now we're going to move on to her shoes. And, well, her feet, I should say. She has these metallic-y socks. And I would take the boots off, but they're really hard to get, on, get back on. Well, not really. It would just take a long time for me. Because, you know, I'm lazy. And the same thing with the um, Mattel pixie magic dolls this type of fabric it starts to like chafe off chafe chafe you guys know what i'm trying to say um it's, yeah it starts to come off and it makes it look white so yeah this one's more orangey than this one you can see there's a difference and the boots are just these plain old these boots look like they could come from a Barbie fashion pack. Which is another thing I don't really like about Jax is because they instead instead of making up new molds, they try to like reuse I guess some other molds. And it doesn't really make the dolls feel special. As special as they could have, I mean. Like they have so much potential. But they just they didn't try. But I can understand because of costs and stuff. But, you know, get on my tails level, Jax. I'm just kidding. Um, yeah. I mean, I love all the dolls the same. And uh, not Mattel. Actually, right now, I think Mattel makes up more of my collection than Jax. I'm not sure. I think they're pretty even. And this is the back of her. As you can see, nothing really special. Well, that was the X that her wings doing. So now for her wings. Um, we start off. Ooh, yes. Her wings are amazing. This is one thing that Jax really did well. Um, so it has this little X right here. Like the Wings logo. Can you see that? Yeah. So then it had we start off with the hot pink glitter lining around the whole wing which i think is beautiful and sometimes the glitter like rubs off but that's only if you're really trying i don't know if you can see the little specks um so then it has like this orange like background with pink and blue stars and it has like okay the occasional glitter but I don't know if that's from the lining or if that's supposed to be there. Either way, it looks beautiful. So it has these like lines and curly cues and these little um, star, pink star gemstones or something. And the white stars in the background along with the white dots. And it's the same down here. And over here. And the back, it's just a lesser version of the front. As you can see, there's no, like, there's no really, they didn't put glitter on both sides, which I kind of really like because, I mean, who's going to really be looking at the back? But, I mean, unless you're, I don't know, imaginative play. I don't think they really care. So, her wings, they have this flapping mechanism. If you put it on the doll's back, they start to flap. I will show you right now and there was a thing of socks right there um in the plastic bag but you know so yeah also here here are the wings on her and then flap 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 
So I think that's really cool for the kids if they're playing and they're like, oh, she can fly. Flap, 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 flap. <laughs> of course, I haven't really played with these because, you know, I got these when, um, I got Bloom and Stella. When I wasn't really into playing with dolls anymore because, you know, yeah. I'm more into, um, shopping, which is really, uh, not good. But I save my money, so. I'm actually probably going to buy some dolls this weekend, so there's that. And thank you guys so much for watching. I'm just going to stop rambling here. Um, I might have another review up, depending on how I'm feeling. So, yeah. Like I said, thank you guys for watching. Um, if you want to, you can subscribe, you can like, you can comment, do whatever you feel. If you want to dislike this video, I mean, I'm... I wouldn't like it if you did, but I mean, if you wanted to, you could you could dislike it. All right, guys. See you later. Bye.